The 27th Ryder Cup returned to American soil. In 87, the U.S. still stinging after its sound defeat of two years before. Jack Nicklaus captained the U.S. squad at his home course of Muirfield Village in Ohio. Tony Jacklin had the American team. And the U.S. was down 10.5 to 5.5 going to Sunday's singles. Eamon Darcy of Ireland for birdie at 15 to square his match with Ben Crenshaw. Crenshaw now for birdie. He had broken his putter nine holes earlier, had to putt with a two iron. Sam Torrance's second shot to 18. One up in his match with Masters champion Larry Mize. The Europeans needing just four points on this final day to retain the cup. Crenshaw now on the tee at 16, all even in his match with Eamon Darcy. Curtis Strange, two down to Seve Ballesteros, cut that deficit at 13 to just one. Torrance now at 18 with the tap in to have his match with Mize. And the European lead now is 12 to 7. Nick Faldo, the reigning British Open champion, one down coming to 18 with a shot from the greenside bunker. Behind them, Payne Stewart with a putt at 17 to stay one up on Jose Maria Olazabo. The Spaniard have the hole, however, to remain one down. Back to 18 now. Faldo for par. Mark Calcavecchia with the tap in. And the victory, a one-up win over Faldo to cut the European lead to 12 to eight. Eamon Darcy's approach now to the 17th. Crenshaw's third shot off the terrible stance into the bunker. And he would wind up all square with Darcy going to the final hole. The Americans draw closer. Stewart with the victory at 18 over Olathabo. And the deficit is just three now, 12 to nine. Crenshaw in trouble again, this time at the 18th. He had to pitch out. Now this is his third shot. Suddenly, an affinity for the sand. Second bunker in a row. Behind him at 17, another match closing out in the Americans' favor. Jose Rivero misses his putt, loses to U.S. Open champion Scott Simpson 2-1. and one. It is now just 12-10 to 10 in favor of the visitors. And it would get closer. Sandy Lyle, Dormy at 16, needing this long putt to stay alive against Tom Kite. Okay, Kite wins it three and two, and the Americans now are suddenly within one point, 12 to 11.
Back to 18 now. Crenshaw from the greenside bunker. You see the ball just to his right. Eamon Darcy with a very similar bunker shot. Now Crenshaw. The putt for bogey. Eamon Darcy now for the win. The one-up victory. And the Europeans' lead is back to two, 13 to 11. <laughs> Savvy now, two up on Curtis Strange on the tee at 16. This putt would retain the cup for the Europeans, but he would save the theatrics for a little bit later. Bernhard Longer now at 18 to retain the cup. He and Larry Nelson both have short putts now. Good, good. As it turns out, yes. And that gives the Europeans a 13 and a half to 11 and a half advantage. And who should be there at the end to nail it down? Sevi Ballesteros, the putt at 16, Defeats Strange 2 and 1, clinches the Europeans their second straight Ryder Cup, their first victory on American soil, and back to back wins for the first time in Ryder Cup history. <laughs>